In this video, I want to talk about the singleton pattern. In object-oriented programming, the singleton pattern is known because it restricts instantiation of a class to a single object. So pretty much you can have only one instance and you have to manage that single instance. Uh, classically, the singleton pattern can be implemented by creating a class with a method that creates a new instance of the class if it doesn't exist. And if it does exist, then it just returns a reference to that object. So I want to give you guys an example of how we can implement a singleton. So here I'm going to write, I'm going to make a singleton. So I will have, I'm going to make a variable right now, which is, which is the instance that stores a reference to the singleton bar instance. So once I make that instance, if I make another instance or call another one, it will just reference the one that I had already made, if one exists. And here I will have my init to initialize my singleton. So here, singleton. So I will write my function, which is private method function. And private. And let me write a private variable. So you guys can see that everything in here is private. And a private random number. And I'm going to return from this init public method. Uh, public property and also the get random number. And here get random number, which is a function. And I'm going to return my private random number. So what I did was make an instance, and that's my reference to the instance, and just a function where I can init my singleton, and it returns this information. But my whole, my singleton, what it returns is the following, get instance, which is a function. And if the instance does not exist, then we make a new one. And if it does exist, then we just return the one that has already been created for us. So let's test this out to see if it really works. So I'm going to do make a variable, single A. I'm going to do my singleton dot get instance. As, as you guys can see, my singleton is what I called here at the top. And get instance is because that's the only thing I'm returning, so that's pretty the only thing that we can see. Because that is what it's getting returned. Then variable single b. So my singleton again. And I'm going to get the instance. So what I'm going to do is I make two different or call two different ones. But in the singleton pattern, they should have the same information. So if I get a random number from single A and a random number from single B, it should be the same. Because once the instance is called here, this one should not create a new one. Should be the same. So single A is my variable get random number is coming from once I call this instance 
then these are my methods for the singleton. Here random number, public property, and public method. And actually I'm gonna console log single A. So you guys can see. I'm gonna console log single B. I will actually there's a code here, so I'll take this out and do node test.js. So single A, which is my single ticket instance, has a public method, public property, and get random number. Single B also has the same information because as line 22. 26, all that is getting returned by the init of when I first made my instance. So when I first called single A, my instance was false, so it created my singleton and gave me all those methods. The second time, it should not create it and just return my regular instance. So when I get a random number from A and a random number from B, these should be the same and I do get true here in the bottom in my console log so our single pattern did work out correctly. An issue that a lot of people miss sometimes when creating a singleton would be instead of this go just write instance and then And that will automatically create an instance for this, and this would be a completely different instance, and that is wrong. You want only one instance. So what makes a singleton is pretty much a global access to the instance. So as I said, you would do my singleton dot get instance. We don't want to access new. My singleton. This is what we want. And that's a singleton for you. Thank you guys.